I really hope I'm in focus. Let's just uh, hope for the best here. Hi everyone, uh, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know who I am, my name is Rachel and yeah, I'm pretty sure like none of you know me or even remember who I am because I haven't made a video in ages. But I have reasons why I have not been, you know, here on YouTube. I've been watching videos and stuff, but I haven't, I didn't have time to make videos and I apologize and I want to be better at it. I really had an itch today to make a video. Since my last video, I graduated college with a BS in kinesiology uh, with an emphasis in neuromuscular science and then I also completed my associate's degree, so my AS in natural biology and then I got a minor in chemistry, so I have one big degree and then two little baby degrees, which I'm really proud of myself and, you know, I did take a little longer in college than most, so, um, but I did come out with more. So now I'm just going to fill you in a little more about what I've been doing since I graduated. For those of you who don't know me, which is a lot of you, um, I think I've mentioned this before on my channel that I really would like to become a doctor. Um, I'm interested in surgery, but, you know, just the big umbrella would be to... Uh, become a physician and that's my passion that's what I live for and I really want to make it happen and it's finally here for me to start making it happen which is really exciting but really nerve-wracking at the same time <sighs> where do I start after I graduated I knew it was time to start looking into the MCAT and I looked online and I wanted to take it in October ish and it turns out that the last test they hold in California for the MCAT was in August. Whatever. So I signed up and my test date is on August 24th. So I'll be taking the MCAT then. So basically a week after I graduated, I strapped down and I started studying like a madman. Um, all of June, I studied for like 8 to 10 to 12 hours a day. I'm going to be transparent with you guys. Like I burned out in June. I burned out at the end of June because I studied so much and so hard and you know I got through all the books that I've got from Kaplan and oh it was like overkill but um you know I'm still going I'm still studying strong I'm really nervous but um that's been my main priority so um that's what I've been doing and you know that's I haven't had a lot of time to be on YouTube just because of that it's been like a huge part of my day it's basically my whole day what else I've been working minimally just because I know that these three months are going to be committed to studying for the MCAT and after the three months are over, after I take that test, I can jump right into the workforce and you know work full time but until then I need to be patient and I need to use my time wisely to study. That's that and I've been volunteering. I've been volunteering in the emergency department at our local hospital and I love it. Like it really confirmed um, like why I want to become a doctor. It's amazing. Just the patients that are in there, they're either in there for a short amount of time or a long amount of time and either to get transferred or discharged and you know that that amount of time that they're in there it's it's uncomfortable for them and it's not the best. You don't want to be there so even though I can't give any medical advice or physically help them I can be there with a warm blanket or a hug or some kind of comfort or conversation for them just to make their stay there a little bit better and positively impact them in that short amount of time that they're there and it's the most rewarding feeling to get somebody that is in an immense amount of pain to smile at you or to engage with you in a positive way and um, I also signed up for this program called Meals on Wheels. They have like this sub program called Friendly Visitors and basically it's just you go and visit elderly people and you can commit just a minimum of two hours a week to go hang out with an elderly person. I think it's going to be really fun because everyone forgets about old people and I think that's so sad because they're people too, they need love, they need comfort. I'll leave a link to the website down below if you guys are interested in volunteering. With this channel, um, I know I want to keep posting videos. I know I want to be better at posting videos and more frequently. But I'll be honest that my videos I think are going to be more geared towards my journey to medical school and then above and beyond that. Yeah, I think my next video will be about how I'm studying for the MCAT. 
yeah i'm happy to be here and thanks so much for watching and if you're not subscribed already please subscribe down below and uh yeah i'll see you guys next time bye